What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. This is going to be another SMP video for all my SMP people out there. I want you to take a look at my head here. It's going to be very important for you guys if you decide to get SMP, especially if you decide to get Subtle P with Scalp Logic, okay? Very important. You can see here my scar extends down to here, right? Well, that's not my scar. That is actually the illusion of, of uh, hair around my skin. All this here in the front is the scalp micropigmentation. All of this. My hair starts growing back here. See that? This is, this is the SMP all over here, which creates the illusion of the scar. And then back here is my real scar, and back here is the hair. Starts about here. Now I have a very bright light on, so this is gonna be a little bit washed out, but you can clearly see where the hair begins and where it ends because I have a lot of day, I have like maybe four or five days, I believe, of growth on my head. So you can completely see that, right? Now I'm gonna show you what it looks like. I'm gonna show you the power of what scalp logic does. This is the power. When I shave my head, you're not gonna be able to tell what is SMP and what is not. Check this out. Perfect time to do it because right now you can tell. Watch this. Do you see the way that blends in? Sorry about all those bells in the background, guys. Try to ignore it. I live in Mexico, so they're like partying out there and the church bells are going wild. But do you see the difference between this and this? Absolutely not, you don't, right? And that's because the scalp logic does what they do. You can't tell what is scalp micropigmentation anymore and what is real. Isn't that crazy? And that is the power of scalp logic. Now you have another option if you want to keep a couple of days of growth on your head. You can buy one of these micro, micro razors that go up by millimeters and you can go ahead and maybe set it. I'm really sorry about the bells guys. You can go ahead and set it to maybe two millimeters cut it down depending on how many days of growth you have on your head and now you see I have a little hair that is blending with the front where the SMP is so then you can keep a couple of days of growth in order to add like the illusion of a little bit more darker or whatever two millimeters looks really really good I could probably drop it down to one or uh, one and a half let's try one and a half and now with that one and a half, you're able to keep a little bit of a darker illusion of hair in order to, you know, maybe enhance the SMP. A lot of people like it when SMP has a couple of days of growth on it. And you can do that with one of these micros. Or you could just do what I like to do and just shave down. Look at this. Look at this. Before you could clearly see where the SMP started and where it ended, but not anymore. Isn't that insane? No other company is gonna make your hair, your real hair look like the, the SMP. It's not gonna happen. At least, well, all right, look, so there's a lot of talented people out there, but it's gonna be very rare. Most people are giving you big, harsh black dots that will not blend into your regular hair. It's, it's not gonna happen. So I really wanted to just show you the power of subtle pigmentation, which is what they practice. Keep in mind, I'm gonna back up just a little bit. Keep in mind that uh, I'm under a very, very bright light. And so because I'm under a very bright light, the results are gonna be a little washed out. And with all, with, with, Full transparency, I do think I maybe need another session or something, but this is it. 
very, very amazing how they can match your actual hair. All right. So hope this video helps catch you guys in the next one. Be safe and have a wonderful day.